Hi. Welcome to Love and Forever Evolving, where we are always and forever evolving. Hello, Libras. Welcome back, my loves. Welcome to your love reading. I hope all has been well, Libra. I hope you've been taking care of yourselves, eating plenty of fruit and vegetables, and taking care of that beautiful, sexy temple of yours, Libras, as it take care of you, my loves. Welcome back. Come on in. Have a seat. We're going to see what messages source your guardian angels and your ancestors have here for you today, Libra, when it comes to love. Yes, love, love, love is in the air, Libras. Shout out to the evolving spirits. Shout out to the soul tribe members, gang, gang. I appreciate you all, Patreon, soul family as well. Thank you for your continuous love and support. And welcome back, Libras, to the ones that are new here. It is an also an honor and a pleasure to have each and every one of you all. Thank you for stopping by and listening in today. I definitely hope the reading to today fulfills your spirit, my loves. And if so, loves, don't forget to like, like, share the content, Libra, with who you know the reading here today may resonate for, my loves. And also, love, subscribe. Be a part of family. We would love to have you here as well as part of our soul family. And this week, we are focusing in on the color green yes i have enjoyed working with the color green this week centering and grounding myself and utilizing my heart chakra which represents the color green so definitely if you're new here libra keep up with the community tab that is where i do post the new colors that we transition into each week we do understand here that colors bring in their own frequency and vibration and in a good way to help guide you all as well along your spiritual path and journey, all right? So let's go ahead and dive into your reading here today, Libra. Let's see what's coming towards you for love, all right? Ooh, well, love, love, love is definitely again in the air for you. Some of y'all, this person could be a Scorpio here, all right? Or they could be a water sign, a Cancer, or a Pisces here, all right? Or whoever this is, they can embody the energies of the card. Anyone can embody the energies here, right? But whoever this particular person or energy here is, they are in love with you, okay? They definitely love you or appreciate you or is definitely gaining feelings for you here, Libra, okay? Wow, so let's get more about this particular person here, all right? This could be a king or a queen of cups here, okay? Just take it how it resonates for you, all right? Again, that is Scorpio energy. Some of you all, particularly this person, may be a Scorpio, all right? So let's see what else about this person here, Wow, we got the Ten of Wands here, okay? This is fire element here, Libra. Some of you are this particular person here. could be a fire sign for others of you all. This could be a Sagittarius, a Leo, or an Aries here, all right? But this particular person here, someone who has been through a lot of burdens here, as you can see, just noticing by looking at the picture here, in this point, they're no longer can carry all these ones by themselves, okay? I feel like not only is this person carrying their own burdens, but they're having to also carry others' burdens here as well. And they've come to the realization, like, somewhere I got to draw the line, I got to stop, I got to rest, I got to figure this out, okay? Because I love Libra, I appreciate Libra and everything that Libra has done for me, but enough is enough, okay? And I also feel like this is how you feel, Libra, when it comes to this particular person. You know, you appreciate this person, you have love for this person, but at the end of the day, love don't pay the bills, okay? And love is not going to keep a relationship where it needs to be if both energies are not reciprocating here. And this is where I feel like the line has to be drawn because it's now becoming overwhelming, okay? It could be even draining you or your partner here because this person is having to take amongst all these burdens or you, Libra, is having to take on all all these burdens from this particular person here at this time and it's becoming overwhelming here okay so let's see what else is this person processing or feeling here at this time yeah look at that we got the five of cups here more scorpio energy here again some of you are libra this person could be have highly places or percentage in scorpio element or you could be a rising venus or a moon energy of Scorpio as well, Libra, for some of you all. But however, I digress. 
this is an energy here again, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, or just whoever's in buying this energy, they're hurt. All right, they're hurt because of someone has disappointed either you, Libra, or disappointed your person here. Because at this point, this person was carrying all the burdens here. Or I honestly feel like I keep having to go back to you, Libra, where I feel like some of you all, most of you all have carried all this person's burdens. You've done everything you could do in this relationship. You put more effort, more time, more energy in this relationship. And for you to find out whatever you found out or have received whatever information you received, it's like as it's holding her hand over her chest as well. Some of y'all feel surprised about this. You can't believe that this is happening to you. You can't believe you even feel this way about this person, that this person would do this to you. And again, you had feelings for this particular person here. And some of y'all may find yourself being very disappointed or having even regrets at this time, as in taking this person in or even giving them an opportunity here. Okay. Okay, and this is something that you realize that, okay, I have to overcome this situation or this obstacle here. This is something here that has been put in front of me for a reason. So I have to figure this out. I got to figure out why I keep coming across relationships or situations or circumstances that are like this. What am I doing? Let's go back to the drawing board here. Okay, because at this time here, this has been for some of you all, there is what? two cups here that are or three cups here that are empty that are has been a disappointment here but for some of you all spirit doesn't want you to give up when it comes to love or just give up on yourself as you notice spirit is showing me that there are two cups in this window with light shining in on them okay so some of y'all may just be mourning over the past here and how you were treated from your past and how you once had these cups fulfilled or filled with water or filled with love and then along the line of situation or circumstance that you found out about these partners or your ex here right that had hurt you or done something here to disappoint you in your past here but know that these were all stepping stones to allow you libra to come a better bird better virgin excuse me of yourselves okay and once you realize that here and realize how lovable and appreciated you are know that you still have two cups here that are literally shining in this window and it's not a coincidence on why these cups are still here standing next to each other side by side with the light or the sun even shining on them too okay so don't forget about that as well you definitely are at a completion here with the number 10 libra so this tells me all these obstacles and burdens and challenges that you had to overcome here is done all these type of relationships are now done. Moving forward, any type of relationship that you get yourself in, it's going to be one where they will support you. They will be reciprocated with you. They will be the one who may even overdo by giving and appreciate you and showing more love than what you even do because of all these other experiences here, Libra, that you had to experience and go through first, okay? How could you be a great teacher or a great uh, person that fits the job if you don't continuously make these mistakes or continuously have these type of experiences? Your teacher is your great experience, okay? Experiences are our best teachers, okay? So this is why you've been through a couple of cups already right that now you know your worth now you know your value and what you appreciate and what you most of all what you deserve so of course you're not going to go down this type of road you now know exactly what to decipher from you know what to look out for because you've already been shown this from individuals these could be different people but came up with the same results when it came to relationships okay none of that was by accident that was to get you ready suited and booted for the person that's going to be reciprocated that's going to be on a much higher frequency and vibration for you libra okay wow powerful reading here today loves as we close out i'm going to use my raw tarot deck here to get you some messages here pertaining this person or the energies now 
that ills around you at this time and how they feel. All right. Wow. We have it's forever over here with you. Okay. Yes. All right. This is what you're going to have to look forward to in the future. Okay. This is someone who also has been through the same obstacles and challenges. I feel like Libra as you have as well. Okay. Yeah. Look at that. I don't care. I want you. Okay. So someone here is going to make it be known here, Libra, that they want to be with you here. My nose is itchy. Okay, so this definitely tells me that this is resonating with someone here. Okay, my nose will not stop tingling. The fairies are definitely having that uh, feather and wishing it over, wish washing it over the tip of my nose. My nose is looking like a red Rudolph right now. I can only imagine. It's so, I'm trying to not itch it as much, but oh my goodness. So this definitely tells me that this is resonating for someone. Wow, we have gossip. Okay, we even have gossip in the streets here about you. You Libra, okay, because of how you have overcame this obstacle from all these other past energies, okay, this could be family here as well that is gossiping here, yeah, we even got the grass is not green on that side, so someone has realized whoever your ex or whoever you may was in a relationship here within the past, they have may have went back to someone else because you decided to tell this person, look, you know, you were one of these cups here in my past and now I'm not wanting to no longer engage in this relationship with you, right? I seen what I needed to see and what I needed to know about you. So this person went back to that other side over there and looks like, of course, it wasn't green over there. So some of y'all, this person here wants to come back, okay? Maybe this is the person that was gossiping or started the gossip here about you as well yeah look at that if i could go back and change time yeah some of you all may feel this way others this person may feel this way because of what they've done towards you in this relationship here yeah and even source said it here not for your highest good okay so this is where i feel like again the terms that you all have come to that these relationships and experiences was not for my highest good they were only here to teach me more about myself okay yeah i am lost and don't know what to do this is where i feel like this person here they're even learning their own ex through their own experience a lesson here as well it's a lesson here for everyone to embrace and appreciate and move forward here and be ready because every level every experience is a new level okay yeah all i want is you this is the energy that i was mentioning that's going to come across you here libra because of the way that you are now presenting yourself from all the experiences here it's definitely molding you into what a relationship is going to actually be or look like right so some of y'all may not even realize that okay so definitely do not give up libra when it comes to love okay definitely if the reading her loves has resonated for you all again don't forget to like like share the content here libra with who you know again the reading here may resonate for and again thank you so much for your continuous love and support so family so tribe i appreciate each and every one of you all Definitely adjust your notification bell for when I go live here on this platform. I do go live for all Zodiac sign readings throughout the week. If you would love to stop by and get a check-in before you get your day started, we have a good time there as well. And again, thank you all so much for your comments and your feedback. I see you, I hear you, and I appreciate you, all right? Delphi, my loves, remember your health is always your wealth, Libras, and we definitely shall chit-chat soon, my loves. You all take care. Mwah! Bye-bye.